That's right, Karen. Before about 50 of those officers were rehired, those patrols simply were not possible. Now many Tulsans say their sense of security is coming back. A DUI checkpoint is something Tulsans saw less of when budget problems forced Tulsa police layoffs. Having all these officers back is definitely a, a, a godsend from that standpoint because it's going to allow us to serve the citizens better. Now, Officer Craig Murray says extra patrols are something Tulsans will slowly see more of. Over the weekend, TPD teamed up with seven other agencies and arrested 34 suspected drunk drivers. Another 49 got speeding tickets. People know they're not supposed to drive and drink, uh, and they also know to wear their seatbelt and not to speed, but uh, we unfortunately caught a lot, but fortunately it was very uh, productive evening. I have a younger sister who is a new driver, and she's out late at night hitting the town, so knowing her, her safety comes first. I totally support it. Officers patrolled areas where bars are saturated as well. I was working uh, Saturday night whenever they got about four people. 60 drivers were ticketed for not wearing a seatbelt. Many Tulsans are glad proactive policing is coming back. When you leave late, there's always that scare that the someone in front of you or behind you can you know, take your life or your friend's life. More than 330 other citations were issued for warrants, drugs, or public intoxication. Despite the efforts, police think alcohol was a factor in a wreck that killed two people. Officers say it is all the more reason to keep bringing officers back to fight crime before it happens. At least 34 of those people that were arrested for drunk driving we know those are 34 lives that we saved, not to mention countless others that may have been involved in a crash had they hit someone. And another 20 officers are expected to be sworn in next week. Reporting live in Midtown Tulsa, Beth Burnett, 2 News works for you.